first are just utter disappointment. The 5 0 up against Exeter after about 25 minutes, and we were going so well. It was the best the team have done all year, you know, and uh, I was just gutted to come off. Well, I've been uh, given my exercise by my physio, I've been working really, really hard on doing all of those, and um, I've got to eat well and. Oh, sorry. Hydration time. As I was saying, yeah, nutrition, hydration, rehab, but mental strength is the most important aspect of my recovery. I wasn't even gonna do it, but. Fuck your bandana, we don't see no colours I want a holiday, I tell them pack your luggage They're like storms, why you only doing covers? I'm sitting on some bangers, you can go and suck your mothers But for now I might just take your little tune in and I kill it We're just warming up, I swear it's been a minute The thing for me it would be leadership is the big one I've watched him in a couple of games now And you know he's the talisman of that Bucks 2 team what he asks from his players, they deliver. Just that's that's the sort of person he is. Leads with his words, leads with what he does on the pitch. And I think just to add to that as well, just mental strength, mental resilience. He came off that pitch, foot straight in the ice. Really, you know, he's just been so driven to get back. He does all his rehab. You know, the ice is on there, the recovery. I think just emotional sort of cushion for him, just bouncing a few ideas off him, um, just trying to keep him upbeat because he's so driven, you know, he can get a little bit down, but I'm just there, emotional walls almost, keeping him constrained, keeping the straight and narrow ready for this, this Bucks final. I'm going to say devastated. It was literally devastating to watch him. You could see the whole players, the whole team just heads went down. That was their man, that was their leader, uh, limping off, off the pitch. And with that, almost the cup dream went because that's what he means to the team. Just, so just devastating, disappointing, but I knew he'd bounce back and I, I honestly reckon he'll be there for the final. Well, he's been getting a lot from you know the friends, the family, but obviously he's got a high social status here at the, the university. A lot of, dare I say it, women being involved in his life friend zone or not, you know, that they're, they're there for him just as much as he's there for them. So, you know, a lot of people behind him wanting him to be there for the final.